The way we came to working with older actors has had quite a complicated route. Um, I think most of, if not all of our shows up until this point, we have worked with either people of our own age or people of a similar age and somehow the shows were based around our experiences and what we wanted to say about our lives at that particular time. With Love Song, through a various series of events, we've come to the conclusion that we wanted to make a show about an age group older and an age group younger, so the people that we might become and the people we forgot we once were. Um, because we feel there's a fascinating gap between those two people, uh, those two generations. Um, and we hadn't done it before. So we very you know, purposefully put ourselves in a position where we're making a show about people that we are not, which gives us a really interesting perspective on those people and gives those people so much that they can teach us about you know, their world and about the, the situation that the protagonists find themselves in, in Love Song. Interestingly, I think with this show, We've kind of, we've got the best of both worlds. I think there are elements in this piece that are really very, very beautiful. And we've also got some areas that are dark, very dark. So I think it's a, it's a development for us in the sense that we've got a piece which um, combines the two. And I think in the past we've gone kind of down a Stockholm route or, you know, the, the uh, relationship between the boxes are beautiful. Burnout is kind of a, a, a kind of, a euphoria, I think, about that kind of relationship. But um, yeah, this one feels a definite kind of step up, and a, a very sophisticated. And through working with Abby, it's a very sophisticated uh, emotional story. So I think um, we feel like we've grown up a little bit with this one. I think the idea of total theatre um, is something that is kind of the only way that we're able to work by bringing together um, responses to um, the the. Um, central theme as, as our starting point but ultimately like this morning we just spent the day sat at the table just going through the script and just listening to music tracks and just seeing which ones open out the, the story and um, so I think that's just one example of a way in which we I don't think it's possible it's possible for us to ever think about one pure um, element in a show because the, the composite whole um, is only there because we're able to um, focus intensely on all the, all the elements I mean, there is something about this show that um, it won't have the explosive physicality of Beautiful Burnout. It doesn't necessarily require it, but it shouldn't be any less explosive. 